This is why Golden Freddy is one of the most messed up origin stories. Golden Freddy is considered one of the most powerful animatronics in the series. Originally, he was called Fredbear, located at Fredbear's family diner. We find out in FNAF 4, a kid known as Crying Child is scared of the animatronic. His brother and friends knew this. They picked him up, putting him in Fredbear's mouth. Since Fredbear is a springlock suit, it crushed him, causing the bite of 83. Because of this bite, many believe Crying Child possesses Golden Freddy. When the restaurant closed down because of this, the owner, William Afton, moved Fredbear to his new restaurant, Freddy's Pizzeria. Many people believe Golden Freddy's possessed by two people. At the new restaurant, five kids were murdered, one of them being Cassidy, who was stuffed in Fredbear's suit, now known as Golden Freddy. The smell from the other animatronic suits was so bad, it caused the restaurant to shut down, causing the suit to become withered. Another restaurant was opened with a new owner. William Afton goes there to destroy the animatronics, but Cassidy, who's controlling Golden Freddy, traps William Afton in the Spring Bonnie suit. Where where he allegedly dies. Since William Afton was able to come back to life, Cassidy creates the game Ultimate Custom Night to house William Afton where he's tortured for all eternity. What character should we cover next? Make sure to follow for more FNAF lore.